I'm Andrew Hoyle for CNET and I'm here checking out the Nokia Lumia 625. It's a colourful budget Nokia with a huge screen. So at 4.7 inches, the Lumia 625 is the biggest phone in the Lumia range. The top end 920 is only 4.5 inches and the 620 that just sits just below this is only 3.8. Sadly, the screen resolution itself hasn't been increased. It's only 800 by 480 pixels, which is very low, especially for a phone of this size. It does mean that um, small text and the lines around some of the big Windows 8 tiles don't look particularly sharp. It's reasonably bright, but it definitely doesn't have the same bold, rich colors and deep black levels of some of the higher end Lumias. Like the rest of the Lumia range, it's extremely colourful. This plastic back panel is available in yellow, in white, green, black, or a ready orange colour. Um, you can swap the cases too, meaning you can pop on a fresh one when your existing case starts to look a bit dirty. You will be able to buy these separately, but Nokia hasn't yet said exactly how much they'll cost. It's uh, running Windows Phone 8 software with the same sort of colourful big tiles that you'll see on any other Windows Phone device. This has got the new Amber update, meaning that it has the smart cam software that lets you take multiple photos at once to create a, an action shot. It's powered by a 1.2 gigahertz dual core processor, which isn't obviously going to be anything like as powerful as some of the quad core chips you'll find in higher end phones, but it still seems quite nippy in my hands-on, and there isn't a whole lot you can really get for Windows Phone devices that's really going to tax that. You'll find a load of the bundled Nokia software on board too, like Here Maps, or the Here Drive GPS satellite navigation, and the Nokia Music streaming program. Around the back, you'll see a five megapixel camera with an LED flash, and a phone itself is powered by a 2000 milliamp battery, which should give plenty of juice. Networks and shops haven't yet announced exactly how much they're going to be stocking the 6254, but it is expected to be SIM free for around 200 pounds, making it a very affordable option. I'm Andrew Hoyle for CNET, and this is a Nokia Lumia 625. <laughs>